Introduction Hey Ria, I have a great news. My sister has given birth to a little boy. Congratulations! Thank you Ria. I wonder how a baby develops in mother's body. Oh, I can explain you how a child is born. Objectives At the end of this lesson, you will be able to understand the process of gamete formation in males and females, understand the menstrual cycle, identify the process of fertilization and implantation, understand the development stages of embryo during pregnancy, understand parturition and lactation. Gametogenesis It is the process of production of gametes. Males and females of a species have different forms of gametogenesis. Spermatogenesis, male. Oogenesis, female. Spermatogenesis The process of spermatogenesis occurs in the seminiferous tubules. It begins with the differentiation of diploid primordial germ cells into diploid spermatogonia in embryonic testes. The spermatogonia differentiates after puberty to form mature sperm as shown in the following diagram. The spermatids are transformed into spermatozoa or sperms by the process called spermiogenesis. After spermiogenesis, sperm heads become embedded in Sertoli cells and are released by the process of spermiation. Structure of sperm Each sperm cell contains Headpiece, which has an acrosome at its tip and contains a haploid set of chromosome in a compact state. Middle piece containing mitochondria and a single centriole. Tail or flagellum. An adult male produces about 100 million sperms each day. Oogenesis. The process of oogenesis begins prior to birth when primordial germ cells undergo mitotic divisions to produce diploid oogonia. Each oogonium develops into primary oocyte by the time of birth. After puberty, during each ovarian cycle, FSH stimulates a follicle to enlarge and the primary oocyte completes meiosis 1, producing one secondary oocyte and first polar body. Meiosis II occurs after the sperm head penetrates secondary oocyte. This completes oogenesis. Menstrual cycle Usually begins in females between the age of 10 and 14. It is repeated approximately every 28 days. The menstrual cycle involves the release of a mature egg from a follicle and the preparation of the uterus for pregnancy. The cycle starts at puberty or menarche and ends at menopause. The menstrual cycle has four stages. Phases of menstrual cycle Follicle phase Ovulation, corpus luteum phase, menstruation. Fertilization. Fertilization generally occurs when the egg is in the upper portion of the oviduct. Only one sperm can fertilize an egg. 
the entry of sperm induces the completion of meiotic division of secondary oocyte. The process of fusion of a sperm with an ovum results in the formation of diploid zygote. Implantation As the zygote moves through the oviduct, it undergoes cleavage to form blastomeres. The embryo with 8 to 16 blastomeres is called morula. Morula divides to form blastocyst. Blastomeres in blastocyst arranges to form outer trophoblast and inner cell mass. Trophoblast gets embedded in the endometrium or implantation resulting in pregnancy. Embryonic Development After implantation, finger-like projections appear on the trophoblast called chorionic villi, which are surrounded by the uterine tissue and maternal blood. The chorionic villi and uterine tissue become interdigitated to form placenta. After implantation, inner cell mass differentiates into three germ layers. Pregnancy Usually lasts for nine months, divided into three trimesters. First trimester, first 12 weeks. Heart develops first, followed by the development of neural tube. All the body systems develop by 8th week in the fetus. Second trimester, up to 24 weeks. Limbs and digits develop. The body gets covered with fine hair, eyelids separate and eyelashes are formed. Third trimester, up to 40 weeks. Full term fetus develops ready for delivery. Parturition The process of delivery of the fetus is called parturition. Fetal ejection reflex is induced by placenta and fully developed fetus. Oxytocin released from maternal pituitary causes stronger uterine contractions resulting in expulsion of the baby. Lactation The mammary glands of females start producing milk at the end of the pregnancy. This process is called lactation. The milk produced during the initial few days of lactation is called colostrum, which contains several antibodies absolutely essential to develop resistance for the newborn babies. Did you know? Assisted reproductive techniques refer to the development of test tube babies from an egg fertilized outside the mother's body. This fertilization is called in vitro fertilization. Summary Let us summarize what we have learned. Spermatogenesis results in the formation of sperms. The process of formation of mature female gamete is called oogenesis. The female reproductive cycle is called menstrual cycle. After fertilization, zygote undergoes repeated divisions to form blastocyst. Blastocyst gets implanted in the uterus resulting in pregnancy. After nine months of pregnancy, the fully developed fetus is ready for delivery. The process of childbirth is called parturition. 
The newborn baby is fed milk by the mother or lactation during the initial few months of growth.